You may have heard people talk about using a binder, particularly soya milk, when preparing their fibers for natural dyeing. Well, what is a binder? There's a long historic tradition in Asia of using soy with natural dyes. Like mordants, a binder can improve the color fastness of natural dyes, but they are not mordants. A reminder that a mordant is a metal salt that forms stable molecular bonds with our fiber and dye, whereas a binder does not form molecular bonds. Instead, a binder traps our dye behind a barrier. But how does it do that? Proteins are formed of long chains of amino acids with a very specific three-dimensional structure. They're delicate and require specific conditions of temperature, humidity, etc. to survive. So when you change those conditions, it's very easy to break or denature the protein. As they denature, the amino acid chains lose their tidy structure. They become scrambled, forming a convoluted matrix within which our dye molecules become trapped. But as your dye isn't strongly chemically bonded to your fibers, if your binder is lost to abrasion, it'll take the color with it. 